The number 5 ranked pandas are looking to become champions again with a more experienced and well balanced team. Already with a 2 nothing start to the season, they look to keep that momentum high. Well, I think everything that we um, earned last year, we earned the good old fashioned way with hard work and sacrifice and attention to detail and you know, we just, we put a lot into it and we, we learned that that's what you have to do, you know, to really be able to maximize what you can do on the court as a team, you have to put the, the hard work in. And if you take a close look at the team, you'll notice that some Panda players have returned to the court like Sutter Mariah Walsh and outside hitter Tessa Hill. Really excited to just get to compete again, I think. When you are injured and you do lose the opportunity to uh, play the sport you love every day, it's just, I'm even excited just to practice or warm up. I mean, it was heartbreaking to see what Tess has gone through over the last three years. And we all were hoping this day would come where she'd be back on the court and, and get a chance to play the sport that she loves. And so we're all really excited for her. And she has a ton to offer all of us. And she makes everyone better that she's around. Not too long ago, the Pandas also welcomed Jess Stroud last year in the middle of the regular season. Gaining that experience, Jess says she feels like she's a bit more ready for the season. I think last year's experience was really unique for me, getting the opportunity to join the team halfway through the season, and it was really great. The team just accepted me right away, and I was there every weekend with the team after that. And then I think that really gives me an advantage going back into this year because I already know the team, I'm close with the team. Jess has that, um, she's just so excited to play and be on the team again because she knows what it's like to, to not be able to play volleyball. So it's really fun to have someone um, that enthusiastic and optimistic and just so excited to be a part of the program. Leadership is definitely something Tessa takes to heart as coming to the season her role has changed in her a title of a Panas veteran. And with an already impressive lineup, Tessa and the Pandas look to give their all for games ahead. The leadership role is something that I've really tried to take on being injured and out all the time because it's something that I'd control over. So now I'd like to see myself um, merging that with play on the court and trying to be a leader not only off the court but on. The Pandas will look to use home soil as an advantage since they will host the Cougars tonight at 7.30 p.m. and tomorrow at 5 p.m. at the Salville Community Sports Centre. For your Golden Bears and Pandas, I'm Odell Nelson.